So you want to trade into news. Now, is that a good idea? Well, stick around because you're about to find out the real truth behind news. I'm Marina, the Trader Chick, and you are watching another great episode of Confessions of a Trader Chick. So, what's news? We hear the rumor, you know, the well, the saying, I guess you could hear, it says, buy on the rumor, sell on the news, right? So right there, we know just from that one saying that we are already getting the news way too late. And that's cool, right? Because if we're smart, we wouldn't even be buying on the rumor in the first place. And we definitely won't be selling on the news because what we do is educated and calculated moves rather than just my grandma said it's a good idea or you know kramer on mad money said it was a good idea as well because again that's already news right so by the time he's saying anything to us it's pretty much a sell or a buy but we don't really know right because we need to make educated rules so here's the thing news can really mess with the market messy it gets super messy and if you are a day trader you really do not want to be part of the news one of the main reasons why i stay out of stocks on especially on an intraday or even a swing trader type of a thing i'm definitely in stocks but for the long term is because of the news right if jeff bezos is getting a divorce amazon's still a freaking awesome company but yet the the stock market price is tanking it why news it's drama it doesn't matter if he's getting a divorce it has nothing to do with amazon when another thing happened i don't remember i think it was with golden i don't remember it was with one of them one of the ceos had some sort of an affair the market tanked it tanked it was the dumbest thing great it tanked and you know what nothing to do with the actual company at all and three months later the market is back up but if you're an intraday trader you don't know the news you're gonna get screwed how about with forex what if trump or any one of our presidents decides to have an issue with one of the other presidents of one of the countries that you are having a pair with right like a forex foreign exchange currency pair whatever i don't know this isn't true but let's pretend so there's you're working with the us and the yen and while you're sleeping and you've got your money in or you could be in it right there waiting for you to find out if your pair is gonna you know be strong or whatever you're working on and all of a sudden trump and the president of japan or prime minister i don't know what they're called is having an issue all of a sudden the currency just goes beyond erratic those are news those are news that we don't have any control over right so the point of news is kind of to stay away from it because everybody's an expert and we really don't know what's true or what's not that's why technical analysis is always going to be your trump card basically it's always going to win however when you are an intraday trader there is a site called forexfactory.com the link is below so you guys can look at it and every day they post what are the news for the day what are the high alert news like the red coded news it could be either you know some sort of a report like the housing report the unemployment report oh if it's an fomc uh day when they're having meetings or minutes or whatever usually affects the market we are prepared for this we know that for instance in the morning at 9 45 there is a news report coming out a report about like say housing or let's say crude or whatever that is a high alert high importance uh news object uh news i guess object i don't know we stay out of the market we're just smart we just don't do markets when there is an actual news happening and that usually happens again with forexfactory.com you can easily find all of that right away and you don't have to worry about it so once the news has passed and the market has teetered off and it's not an, as indecisive as it usually is when news happens and trust me i cannot even tell you the amount of traders that say oh but you know the market is so strong going down the news isn't going to affect it i'm staying in and all of a sudden news comes out and it booms up or vice versa or whatever you get immediately stopped out because you're also 
somewhat smart by having a risk in place, right? But sometimes it could blast through your risk and you'll be out way more. Why chance it? Why chance that, right? Remember, I have a great video on FOMAT, fear of missing a trade. Remember, there's always another trade coming and you really don't want to be in a trade or getting into a trade when news is about to come out. So stay out of news. If you're an intraday trader, you know when they're happening, stay out. And if you do get into news and you want to buy on the rumor and you want to sell on the news, I'm sorry, it ain't going to happen. You are not going to be a good trader that way because you don't know when the actual rumor is happening and you don't know when the actual news is happening because we as individual traders, retail traders, we don't have that control. We do not have that power. We do not know what's going on. And it's simply not worth the stress for us to try and figure it out or try to pretend you know, that we know what's going on. So the best thing to do is simply know when to stay out when the news is happening and listen to the market when it has been in regular momentum mode. Because it's hard enough to trade. Do you really want to put an extra element of a challenge on there? So I'm Marina, the trader chick. I also have a free mini course, simplifyingdaytrading.com. I talk a lot more about this so that you guys are doing the right thing. Day trading does not have to be hard. It can be simple, but you got to follow the rules. You got to understand what's going on. Don't not follow the rules because rule breakers are really the ones that do the best but you do have to have a system you do have to know what you're doing you cannot just erratically get in because there's a rumor or that somebody said this or that somebody said that or you say well the market is heading in this direction and news comes out and it blows you out and you're just like oh i can't believe it but you knew the news was coming out so why risk it why all right i'm marina the trader chick subscribe to my channel i've got a lot more goodies for you so you could know exactly what needs to be done and you could have fun doing it. Simplify your trading.